Have you ever went to the church with your girlfriend and the pastor say, your girlfriend, my daughter, you will marry a doctor. You have a doctor. You have no hope of doing any doctorate, doctorate course because you have F9 in mass, F9 in biology, F9 in, in chemistry. It's amazing. Well, one day I went to the church. And the pastor turned to, to, to me to ask. He told us, touch your neighbor. I touched my neighbor. Surprisingly, I found my landlord is my neighbor here. My landlord told me, uh, the pastor told us, tell your neighbor that in, in God's name, your landlord will forgive you your debt. I touched my neighbor. He was my landlord, really. I told your landlord. He told me I will not forgive you. <laughs> the pastor said, say it the second time. I said, I, I said, you are the Lord who will forgive you. The Lord. He told me, me, I will not forgive you. That's what he told me. <laughs> I was like, he said, tell him that nothing can, no one can say no if Jesus says yes. I died. No one can say no if Jesus said yes. He said, but I will not. I need my money. <laughs> he said, if you feel like something is disturbing you and something has refused it, say fire, say me fire. He slapped me. <laughs> slapped me. <laughs> you know, I, I like that so much. I like Red so much because Red is our mom, our, our mom is. One time, there are some ladies who, who go to church looking for people who dress well, looking for people with nice cars, looking, looking for people who stabilize them financially. But that's not a way, a good way of getting a, a man who stabilizes you financially. If you want to get a man who stabilizes you financially, please look at it in the Bible. <laughs> if he has a new Bible, just know he has money and he can give you. If he has an old Bible, just know he has money, but you will never get any of his wife. New Testament, Psalms, all of us, those are the I think was <laughs> my daughter got an ROC1, ROC2, ROC3, ROC4, ROC5. Tell them, please pray for me, find out in the church, pray for me. They are too low. <laughs> ah, let me see something, some people say we have a little. You know, I, mean, I like music so much. I like music. So, you know, I'm a, I'm a gospel comedian, but sometimes, every time when I go to do comedy, I like teaching people, taking people with what's coming. But there's one thing which I thought you teach is all about prayer. Because prayer is a personal contact, from, is a spiritual contact from a person to God. <laughs> but there are things which are Fun. The way the way people pray. When you go to Nigeria, Nigeria, when they are playing, they command God. They start. I'm 
when you are standing, you could have bad man, Jesus, just make God. <laughs> when they are saying amen, they don't say amen, they say, oh, oh, oh. That's, that's, but when you come together, you got it. You got it. It's what? The first time you were present, the rock, you, the, the rock, the rock man, the piano man, the other people, they start like they are from me. Plus the chocolate. 